Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to get the white duffel bag from Director Mode trailer. So let's just begin. Once in Director Mode, you're just going to go down to Online Characters and short shortlist your GT Online 1 character. And then you're going to go into Animals and shortlist a bird of your choice. So I'll be using the seagull today, but you can use any bird except for the hen. Once you've done that, all we're going to do is jump into an invite only session. Once you're in the invite only session, locate the time trial for this week. And you're going to want to find a parachute job that is nearby that time trial. So I'm just going to walk into this parachute job, launch the job. And once the parachute job starts, all you're going to do is jump out of the helicopter, press X to open your parachute, press up on the D-pad to bring up your phone, and quit the job through your phone. Once you're back into a lobby, you're just going to fly up in the air on an oppressor or in a helicopter, jump off, open your parachute, and land near the time trial. Once you've landed, you're just going to locate any street vehicle and drive it into the purple time trial marker. Then press right on the d-pad to start the time trial. Then go options online and select creator. This allows us not to get stuck in the loading screen when going into story mode. Then we go down to the bottom and press exit to Grand Theft Auto 5. Once we're in director mode, we're just going to go down to shortlist and we're going to swap between our GT Online 1 character and our shortlist bird. Now this duplication process will take anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes. I usually time for 25 minutes, so I'll be back when the birds finish duplicating. Once the birds finish duplicating, your GT Online 1 character will spawn on the hay. From there, we're just going to delete the bird by pressing triangle. We're going to press circle to go back. Then we're going to go into actors, beach bums, and press square to look through random modded outfits. Now, if something like this is going to happen to you while doing this, you're swapping through different sections and you get the default characters. Don't worry. All you have to do is go to animals re-shortlist your bird, go into shortlist, and swap between your character and the bird again until your character spawns back on to the hay. So you see in this instant I just went back, forth, back, forth, and my character as you can see is on the hay again. So then I just delete the bird by pressing triangle once more, press back, go into actors, and then continue looking through categories and you should get your modded outfits back. So now as you can see, I found an outfit with the duffel bag and a Christmas mask, which is what you need to find. Um, it's not impossible. You can find the duffel bag with a Christmas mask, as you can see I did. So all you're going to do is press triangle to shortlist the outfit. Then you're going to go into your shortlist and you're going to press X to bring the outfit into director mode. So once you load into director mode, you're just going to want to run around for 20 to 30 seconds. I really took my time with this to make sure that everything just registered and I just tried to climb and jump around and be a derp. So that's what I did here and I kind of got stuck, which was cool. <laughs> um... Yeah, so I took my time, I ran around, and then I opened my interaction menu and I went back to direct mode trailer. Once I loaded back in from the trailer, I went back into direct mode, did the same thing again, ran around, climbed around for a good like 30 seconds to a minute, and I just really wanted everything to register. <laughs> So now we're just going to go and select quit director mode and make sure you do everything really slow, really calm, take your time, um, don't rush it or else it can make the glitch mess up. So you're going to get this alert and you're going to slowly accept it and you should load into story mode with the outfit. And we're going to do the same thing here, just run around for 10-20 seconds and then we're going to open our interaction menu and go back into director mode. 
Then once we're in there, we're just going to quit and exit the story again. And rinse and repeat the same process. Run around for 20, 30 seconds. And then we're going to go options online and enter an invite only lobby. So once you load into the invite only lobby, you should have the outfit if everything is done correctly. In the gameplay here, you can see that I do have it. The Christmas mask just disappeared. And yeah, that's it. Um, I'll show you in a minute the save method. It's the same as other um, duffel bags. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I've been really busy with college, but my school is all done now. So I'll have more time to make content for you guys, which I'm really excited about. So yeah, same process, process as the other bags. Just go into a helicopter or on an oppressor, jump down, and you're going to want to crash into the mask store. And right before... Uh, sorry, right after your character takes off the parachute, you're going to spam right on the on the D-pad to save this outfit. And I obviously save these outfits more than once. Save it two or three times to make sure it really saves. And that is it. You can back out of the mask store and open your outfits and you'll be able to select it and your duffel bag will still be there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I missed doing this so much um and i will see you guys in the next video bye